So everybody, <laughs> this is what I heard at half past four this morning and what so many of you heard at half past four this morning. This hapless old buffalo has given his last sacrifice to the wilderness and this is my first meeting with the magnificent five Birmingham male lions. a little bit here and see if we can't get a bit closer in. Now what's interesting to me today is that only one of them called. He is not excellent from where we are. I'm just going to stick my nose in here. And be Go in there. Guys, I think this is, is that buffalo that was killed. That, that very injured fellow who was hanging around. These lions would have immediately figured out that he was weakened. Now we're only about, um, I think probably about three or four hundred meters from the camera where you all heard this distressing sound of a buffalo being killed and so Velma in Michigan about 400 meters away from the camera Now, everybody, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to call Scott in. He's right nearby because I don't want to miss out on quarantine who we saw yesterday. So just excuse me one second. Scott is like well, about 100 meters away. Scott, come in. Scott, Scott, come in. Scott Dyson, Scott Dyson, come in. <laughs> Scott has a flat tire, that's why he stopped so close by. <laughs> what we'll do is we'll call him in to watch this kill and we'll go and try and find Quarantine again. Quarantine, for those who don't know, is a young male leopard, but I'm the only one who knows where he is at the moment, so. Uh, because he was on a kill yesterday, so there's so much action around here, it's difficult to know where to look. But we'll stay with these magnificent lions until Scott's there's a rather a grim sight of the stomach contents being torn out of this poor old boy. But he really was in a bad way, and you can still see it from the sort of... You can 
see from his four quarters, if you look at the four quarters of the buffalo, he's in really not in a good way. You can see the muscle definition has almost completely disappeared. But I tell you what, despite the fact that he was being attacked by these five huge male lions, this buffalo took at least 40 minutes to die. Good morning. Some lions over here. Really? <laughs> you were wondering what they were. They were on our back porch last night. <laughs> so in case you didn't hear me there, I think you'll find that this buffalo took at least half an hour to die, even though he was being attacked by these five huge male lions. You can see they're not quite at full adulthood yet. Their manes are still quite scraggly, but they're an intimidating group. And a quick question from Tammy, just to give you an idea of the location. They're on a road called Mvubu Road, which is just in front of Gallego Camp.